Believe it or not, I did once love my Fluffy. We were best friends. Any bad day was made better by finding her waiting at home, excited to greet me. Toffee was mine, and only mine. Daddy! Somehow, I thought she might not possess the same vile, selfish desires as most mares. But it was just a matter of time before her biological instinct kicked in. She wasn't satisfied with me anymore. She wanted babies. I grew to resent her more and more. And eventually, I resolved to make her suffer for it. All right, Toffee, if that's what you really want. But just remember, Fluffies can only ever have babies once. Toffee, no, no, that. No way. We'll be the bestest mama ever. Courtesy of a particularly agreeable owner of a male Fluffy in the park, I made it happen for her. I also had her sterilized to future-proof my plans. Maybe it was wishful thinking, but I felt like knowing these would be her only babies made the maternal bond stronger than with most mares. She was certainly more protective of them. I took great care in seeding the next step of the plan. I had to make sure she didn't think it was my idea. Her foals loved how comfortable and warm the fresh laundry was after the drying cycle was complete. As far as she remembered, she had discovered this herself. Eventually, she even started putting them inside the drum all by herself. I wasn't even bothered by the mess the foals made on my clean laundry. I was brimming with anticipation for the next step. Toffee, what have you done? Sorry, Toffee. We can't get them out yet. We need to wait until it's finished. Then we can see if your babies are okay. She waited by the door the whole time. For an hour and a half, she watched her babies die. A terrifying, painful death. In the end, it made no difference.